Roadkill data is actively being collected from drivers using a relatively new app made by the state. We first told you about the Roadkill app last winter. Now Fish and Wildlife say they've seen more than 200 reports sourced from it. Jens Hawkins Hilke of Fish and Wildlife says crowdsourcing Roadkill data helps track animal migration patterns and allow scientists to see what animals are habitating in what part of the state. It's really early to tell. We're trying to collect information about all of Vermont's populations, and so just a few hundred records isn't much. So it's going to be a while before that's a usable data set for us, uh, but for right now, we're trying to get the word out and get as many people using it as possible to really help us fine tune where those most important crossing areas are. Based on the map of roadkill reports on the Agency of Natural Resources website, some dense areas of roadkill are on 89 in the Randolph, Georgia, Richmond, and Waterbury areas. State officials encourage you to pull over and report roadkill once you're in a safe spot and not driving.